What's going on everybody? Welcome to a new segment here on the channel called Before They Were Hype. We're gonna be going over some of the biggest names in fashion, some athletes, pretty much anyone who's had an influence in the streetwear and sneaker world and seeing what they were up to before they got famous and how their style has changed throughout the years. Today we are gonna be looking at none other than Fear of God founder Jerry Lorenzo and seeing what he was wearing before the hype. My background is mixed and I've got some black and some hip hop in me. I've got some white and some grunge, if that's what you want to call that, you know, mixed in with my foundation, which is Jesus Christ and Christianity. And that's that's fear of God. Before the distressed jeans and the boxy tees and the multi-million dollar clothing company, he was just a college student working as a stock boy at a clothing brand called Diesel. It was then Jerry got his first start into the fashion world by working as a stylist for pro MLB player Matt Kemp. JC Ramirez still going as the pitcher as Kemp sends a high drive to center. That ball is gone! Realizing he wanted to fill a void in the market for high-end clothing, that's when Jerry Lorenzo started his own brand called Fear of God. My inspiration was this, like, punk white kid. Um, that represented this grunge culture in high school that I wasn't necessarily ever a part of, so I kind of like fantasized about it kind of thing. With heavy influences drawing from grunge, metal, and even sports culture. And it was not long before celebrities such as Kanye West, Big Sean took a strong liking to his clothing, and now we know Fear of God as one of the biggest streetwear brands around today. All right, so enough background information. We now got none other than Tan Tan to help break down some of these Jerry Lorenzo outfits Ooh. before the hype. Yo, I'm pretty excited to see how his style has changed throughout the years. Let's get into it. Let's do it. All right, Tan, so for the first photo, we got Jerry Lorenzo 10 years ago in Ooh. 08. Bam! Oh, okay. So he's rocking, you know, like the oversized suit right now. Mm -hmm. What do you think? What do you think? Obviously, he has his own flair, his own taste to it. You can see he's got the baggy pants on. You know what it kind of reminds me of? Mm. is like Fear of God right now. Okay. You got high quality clothing, you know yeah. what I mean? But you have a streetwear feel to mm. it. And that's what the suit kind of reminds me of. Our goal with Fear of God is to continue to disrupt and to um, create new rules and, and, and break barriers. So whether we're streetwear, whether we're on luxury or designer, like, you know, that's the, that's the last thing we're concerned about. So for the next photo up, we got BAM! Oh man, you can't blame him because uh -huh. that galaxy print, that was hot back in the yeah, day. Yeah, I think this was about like 2011, <laughs> maybe 2012. He's probably rocking the Galaxy phones. Oh, that was about the <laughs> Galaxy. Oh, One thing, though, know, we got to bring up huh. the V neck under. Oh. V -neck. This is when Lil Wayne, Lil yes. Wayne was hot back then. All right, man, this is pretty funny. 2011, 2012, Jerry Lorenzo, mm -hmm. he had the all galaxy with the V-neck. Let's keep it moving. So you got this photo here. Again, he's rocking the V-neck. Yeah. As you can see, the V-necks were heavy yeah. back in the day. Shout out to Jerry, man. He was out in the clothes with all the celebrities. You got Ivan Jasper, uh -huh. Kid Cudi, the guy from the, the Black Eyed Peas. Yep, that's okay. him. Jerry Lorenzo used to be an event planner. Okay. So for celebrities, because he had to connect with Matt Camp and everything. So mm. now, obviously, you know, Fear of God is worn by so many celebrities. Makes sense. He had the connections back Yo. then. I'm not sure if I'm seeing things, but when I saw the Kerry Hilson music video when they were in the club scene, I think I saw Jerry Lorenzo in the background sitting down with Nicki Diamond. I think I'm gonna kick it with my girl today. Okay, this picture right here, obviously he's got on the Rick Owens shorts, the yeah. Rick Owens boots. Rick Owens, I think, was a pretty good influence he on the fear of God, right? Heavily inspired. And you can see this is the, the year where it kind of all kind of started, fear. the look yeah. of how fear of God came to be. So for the next photo, we got him, bam! Okay. So this Ooh. might have been around like 2013, mm -hmm. I would say. He might be rocking fear of God samples, yeah. you don't know. I mean, that sweatshirt alone's already big enough. Yeah. That t-shirt underneath, for it to show, that's pretty long right yeah, there. Yeah, because I, I don't want people to get it confused. Like when it comes to layering, he was layering, but it was longer. It was yeah. drapier. It was just his own style that he was really getting known for at the time. Let's go over the shoes though. Those are, okay, he's rocking the Bisms. Mm. Okay, for a long time, those are pretty hype. Bro, um, would you say Kanye or Jerry? Ooh, like, you know, like, or did they have an equal amount of hype I would those say up? equal. But when it comes to the outfits, uh -huh. I, I, I kind of ran towards Jerry. If you I, knew, you knew, you yeah. know. This was the start of him hyping up some shoes. Oh, for sure. You Let's know, that's why I wanted to bring up the shoe because he hypes almost every shoe he wears. They call this the Jerry effect, all right? Mm -hmm. If you guys don't know what the Jerry effect is. <laughs> pretty much whatever he was wearing had an effect on people. I mean, you know, everybody was guilty of it. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie. All right, Tan, so we gotta move on to some would say 
is prime. All right, let's bring up these photos. Bam! Oh man, this was the birth <laughs> of the Jerry Boys. Oh my, the birth of the Jerry Boys! Come on, Lem. Very good. Push, push. The Jerry Boys. Everyone uh -huh. just pretty much copying the way Jerry Lorenzo looked at this time. First of all, you gotta say, this is probably Jerry's, I would say, best year. Let's just go over the celebrity aspect and how it affected the success of Fear of God. Huge, huge. You got, uh, obviously, Kanye West. Kanye West. Big Sean. Mm -hmm. You got uh, Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber was a huge one, especially on the tour uh, moving Ooh. forward. You got dudes rocking Justin Bieber tour merch designed by Jerry Lorenzo's team. I've been lined up since two o'clock in the morning. Are you here for the merch or for Bieber? The merch. The merch. I'm here to get some clothes. He went from just kind of wearing a lot of my stuff and then saying, hey, he wanted me to do the wardrobe for his tour. All right, guys, so that pretty much wraps it up for Jerry Lorenzo's Before the Hype. It was pretty interesting to see how his style has evolved throughout the years, man. I mean, some of those outfits from back in the day, I, I, I just cannot see him rocking that now. And kinda you can crazy. just kind of see how much the style has changed throughout the years. Undeniable, his influence on fashion. Hopefully you guys learned something new about Jerry, maybe gained a little bit of insight, but let us know down in the comments below who you guys would like us to cover next in our Before the Hype series. And that's pretty much it. Shout out to Tan, and until next time, we out. Peace. All right guys, thank you for checking out that video. Make sure you guys check out this video. Also check out this video. Be on the lookout for more Before the Hype videos coming out very soon on your favorite celebrities. Um, let us know who you guys would like us to cover next. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, share this with your friends, and that's pretty much it. And until next time, we out. Peace.